Well, hey Terry, we're from Ignite YYC. How are you? Good, how are you? Good. Do you have time for 43 questions? I do. I do. First question, where are we right now? We're at 7K Panorama Ranch up near uh, Okotoks in, in Millerville. This is Michael. Michael owns the property. It's beautiful, Hi. Michael. Welcome, welcome. Thank you. Terry, I'd like to ask you a question. Who is your greatest inspiration? My grandmother. She's uh, from the Ukraine and she, she took us through uh, family values and tradition, but she really told us how to uh, be Canadian. Fantastic. What would people be surprised to know about you, Terry? Uh, I'm a detailed guy. I'm analytical. I'm an uh, analytical junkie, so I like to know a lot about figures and, and data and stuff like that. Cool. What's your favorite thing about Calgary? Things get, shit gets done here, you know? <laughs> you know, like everything's happening because uh, I think it's the, the, the thought and the, the thinking that people in Calgary have is they get it done. Best vacation? Uh, we took the family to Cuba. Five material things you can't live without? Uh, utility tool, a sketch board or a sketch pad, um, a cordless drill. <laughs> uh, I, think that's, I, I think that's all I need. That's all I need. Cat or dog? Dog. What is your favorite local restaurant? Oh, I can't name one. I gotta say five. All right, uh, let's have So, like, it. Char Cut is number one, probably, or up there. Uh, <laughs> Nina's for their burgers. Uh, Holy Smoke for their pulled pork and their and their pork sandwiches, they're fantastic. Uh, I think that's about it. Oh, and Downtown Foods. Downtown Foods Bistro is a pretty good place too. Some guilty pleasure food? Uh, ribeye steak. <laughs> <laughs> We're in Alberta. Can't go wrong with yeah. <laughs> What's the best adjective to describe yourself? Probably not an adjective, probably a verb. I'm an accelerant. Look, put like putting a fuel on a fire. Excellent. Other than YYC, what's your favorite city in the world? Uh, just came back from Rome. Love Rome. Guilty Pleasure TV show? Uh, anything Anthony Bourdain does. Love it. Love it. <laughs> One thing that would make you get on an airplane tomorrow? Family. What's your spirit animal, Terry? Uh, my kids say a Sasquatch, but uh, I'm more the bear. <laughs> What's your favorite song right now? Uh, Gord Bamford's uh, Your Lips Are So Close. Uh, favorite song of all time? Uh, Van Morrison, Have I Told You Lately That I Love You. Vacation, beach or ski hill? Uh, water, fishing. Nice. Who would play you in a movie of your life? Um, Fred Flintstone. Okay, nice. Uh, who in the world would you take a bullet for? Uh, pretty much the family, any family member. Is there a blog that you follow closely? Uh, Monday Morning Memo. In your opinion, what's the top place in Calgary for happy hour drinks? Crafts, uh, Beer Market, or any of the national ones. So, what's your favorite dessert? Banana cream pie. If you could have a superpower, what would it be? Kung Fu Grip. <laughs> What's your idea of a perfect date, Terry? Uh, falling off the grid, grabbing my wife Maria and uh, heading out to the mountains to watch the sunset. Amazing. What's the most dangerous thing you've ever done? Uh, playing contact sports, not being aware enough of head trauma. Taking too many shots to the head. Yeah, fair enough. Uh, who's the last person that you texted? Curtis Glencross. <laughs> no <way>. Game 7, <laughs> Capitals. So I, uh, I texted him this morning. That's wonderful. Uh, what is the best commodity to be invested in right now? Feeder cattle. All right. Is that a feeder cattle outside behind the barn there? Yeah, it's a, a longhorn. <laughs> hey, oysters, east coast or west coast? Prairie oysters. <laughs> what is a prairie oyster? Uh, <laughs> it's the leftovers from converting a bull to a steer. All right. <laughs> So Terry, you work at a bank, but you don't really strike us as much of a banker. What is it that you do? I look after the brand and reputation for ATB agriculture and business. So we're in rural Alberta. We are. What's your favorite rodeo event? Uh, it's either going to be Strathmore or Pinocchio, one of the two. I love the running of the bulls at, at uh, Strathmore, but Pinocchio is big and exciting. What inspired you to have a career in agriculture? Probably not what, it's probably who, the guys at AdFarm. I used to work at an agency called AdFarm and they really got me uh, hooked around uh, being passionate about agriculture. Awesome. Hey guys, how's it going? Good. Hi. <laughs> when are you at your best? Uh, fourth quarter, when everything's on the line. When are you at your worst? Uh, when there's nothing to do. Terry, can you tell us about Beer University? Uh, I can. It's all about education. It's about Alberta. It's about the farmer. It's about uh, understanding how much we contribute to the uh, GDP. Have you earned your PhD yet? Nope, working on it right now. What is one big misunderstanding you think Albertans have about the agriculture industry? 
probably about our contribution to the actual GDP without in uh, Alberta and to Canada. And what can Calgarians do to learn more about the industry? I think they got to ask questions about their food source, not about the safety, where it comes from, who's making it, and the why. Ask a lot of questions. Have you ever branded cattle? Yes and no. Uh, kind of a pecking order when it comes to uh, when it comes to branding cattle is I've been involved with branding, but I've actually not been the brander because it's still a couple of years away. I'm the guy down on the ground holding the cattle down oh. still, so I haven't branded it. Okay, for branding for sure. bit of a pecking order. Yeah. How much does Alberta beef contribute to our national GDP? Well, Twelve point seven billion dollars, and we uh, we contribute forty four percent of the beef in Canada. You're working on so many cool projects, Terry. Is there anything coming up that we should look out for? Uh, probably our seat at the table. It's a, it's a collaboration between uh, Alberta Motor Leagues, Alberta Culinary Tourism Alliance, Travel Alberta, Ourself and Tourism. And it's all about the conversation that's happening around the table. Be it that. politics, be it women in business, be it entrepreneurs, be it agriculture, be it beer. So it's all about the conversation. Cool. If you had to pick one, what would be a quote that sums up how you live your life? Um, the future belongs to the few of us that are still willing to get our hands dirty. I love that too. What is it about Alberta that makes you excited to get up every single day? I think it's just the possibilities. I mean, you know, it's that work hard, play hard attitude that exists in this province and people get shit done. And you want to be a part of it. It's enthusiastic, it's contagious, all of those components. So, yeah. Wonderful. Thanks so much for having us, Terry. Is that 43 already? That's 43. Cool. See you later. Thanks. Cheers.